You're watching Bolt the Official. Please sit back, relax, like, comment, and subscribe, and let's get on with the video. Hi, I'm back with another banging video, so you better fucking like and subscribe and watch all my other videos or I will find you. Anyways, before we begin this video, I just want to say that I got into the YouTube Partner Program, which basically means I can monetize my channel, which I've decided for now that I will not try to do as much. If you see some mid-roll ads in some of the videos, those are placed by YouTube manually, and it's fucking annoying. Anyways, honestly, I will try to do some other shit with the YouTube Partner Program that I just got into, including memberships and even a charity shit, so that's pretty cool. So yeah. Yeah, let's get on with the video. Alright, so welcome to this video. Anyways, Bruce or Ruri or whatever you fucking pronounce it, I'm gonna call it Ruri in this video because it's a long name and I don't know how to pronounce it, okay? Anyways, there's been multiple screenshots that I've gotten from my friends, including Ty and Orochi, about this whole shit. And I'm just gonna go through some of them and the most important ones to basically tell you who this person is. And then I want to discuss something that happened recently. So, uh, in this screenshot on the screen right here, the user says, Ru showed lewd content to her majority minor audience, which is the Twitter audience of 13-year-old horny children on the platform every single day by the RTZ community. Not a surprise it happens all the fucking time anyways it's clear evidence here that it's this is some lewd fucking shit only i am i am vu do we find these long legs cute wow this is supposed to be a mother with a child guys it's stated by rax by the way a mother with a child hmm interesting a mother with a child is out here showing lewd images to minors great holy shit anyways there's also this screenshot which also caused a lot of debate which is this one. I hate that people be doxing people over the dumbest shit in the RTC and yet nobody has tried to dox this back kid. I know y'all can't do it, it shows y'all really be caring more about petty drama than real issues. Now is the time you have the ability so we can contact 911. And honestly, I don't know the context behind any of these screenshots that I'm showing the video. I'm just saying, there's no perspective whatsoever where doxing is supposed to be a good thing. And this screenshot Screenshot also shows that she says that people really be doxing people over the dumbest shit in the RTC, yet she wants to dox someone else for some other dumb shit like oh, she's so hypocritical to the point where I want to kill myself. Anyways, there's also this screenshot which was the original screenshot that caused a lot of drama and a debate in the commentary community and the Roblox RTC community which caused me even to making this video in the first place. Little do you know, there are people like me who are very smart with computers. I just might track down your IP address and send them all the shit to your school and then you can face everyone instead of hiding behind a screen and acting like you're traumatized lol. You're threatening to dox a little child and you still think you have moral superiority. And then <laughs> so Rui here responds with, no I just send it to their school like people all do the time. <laughs> You telling me that this RT influencer wants to dock somebody's school or whatever, send some shit to a school. I, uh, oh my god, I'm crying right now because of the cringe I'm seeing on the screen. Honestly, it wouldn't even surprise me if she would dox me right now to figure out where to live and sue me. If Huh, a mother with a child, by the way, is seeing this on the internet. Yeah, let's dox this kid. Send all the information to a fucking school. Yeah, great, dude. Anyways, what's next? My friend Itsuki told me, Yeah, well, they lied. And then y'all about to get the cops called on y'all tomorrow. So, let me get this straight. So, I don't know what the fuck the context is here. But honestly, from the screenshot, I can tell that it's just some fucking irrelevant shit. She says here, Yeah, well, they lied. Y'all about to get the cops called on y'all tomorrow. So, here, she's saying that she's gonna call the cops on them. <laughs> That, that's a really threatening message on Twitter, by the way. A mom, who has a kid, by the way, is saying this on Twitter. Oh yes, because of petty drama on the internet, I will call the cops on you, you pathetic child. You should die in a hole and kill yourself. She is also apparently not really against religion. Now, I actually know most of the context behind this. So, here she says, fuck your religion. And, do you want to know the context?
context behind this. So basically, um, there are people not supporting the LGBT community because of their religion, and like, I guess that it's wrong, but at the same time, some are just religious believers that have been around in the community for so long, and they just believe that the LGBTQ is just some shit that is sin, or what do I know? I'm not one of those people, so I can talk for my religion, I guess, in some sense. Anyways, there's no- even if somebody says that they don't support LGBTQ, you shouldn't go to for the first option, harass the user and its religion. Now, what would be better to do? 1. Harass the person that just said they don't support your fucking- uh, your fucking agenda. Or 2. Just try to talk to the person and say, okay, that's fine, you don't support me and that's fine because it's just real religion and we have different beliefs. Wait, which, which, which option is better, guys? I'll, I'll give you 10 seconds to think. No, I'm not giving you 10 seconds. It's fucking obvious. Choose option B, dude. Anyways. Yeah, honestly, I when I'm seeing this mother with a child, by the way, I'm thinking of Rax and little I am cat combined into a monstrosity of a quote-unquote mother, by the way, suing children on the internet because of stupidity of drama, doxing, and some other shit I've seen so far. And you know what's ironic? The same very person who is being mad over somebody who uh, dislikes their agenda because of someone's ill religion she literally says herself kill lgbtq people how ironic is it that you're out here saying that people should fuck your religion because they're against your sexuality or your agenda now you're saying the exact same fucking thing. Oh my god, I'm actually getting a seizure and a stroke. You know what? I, I shouldn't have made this video in the first place because you know what? <laughs> I'm getting a fucking stroke and seizure. Anyways, I want to mention two things. One, the first thing I want to mention is the fact that Orochi, Tai, all my friends who are involved with this petty drama is apparently being sued by her. Now, I don't get any screenshots on this, but assuming that she is hiding all her tweets, I have have a feeling that there's some very very shady shit going on her account and i've tried to follow her for a while she doesn't really like me hmm i wonder why is it because she stole my thumbnail and used it as a banner on her own twitter profile hey let, let me explain this to you for a moment she used my expose a thumbnail for her twitter banner she, i think she realized very quickly that that wasn't fan art because she now has changed it and it hasn't been changed for a while so it just shows that it was just a mistake but honestly you should have kept that banner on so i could have taken down your twitter account for stealing my art now she's probably gonna try to strike this video and honestly all i have to say to that no you're not because i have all the rights to the content there is in this video and you have no rights to strike me i have all the evidence i have all the Proof for this to be my video, my rights, and all content is owned by me. If you try to strike this video down because you're a mother who claims that they want to sue children on the internet because of petty drama, then I will have no further thing to do than just to take it up with a local de police department in your country. It's probably the United States because why do you want to sue children otherwise from the United States? I wonder. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video basically me criticizing criticizing her for deplorable actions and statements on Twitter, and I also want to mention the fact that suing children on the internet for petty drama just shows your morality sense and how care mode you can be. <laughs> honestly, if if I was that person, I would honestly just have let the platform from a while ago because there's no point of being in this stupidity of drama, trying to defend yourself from all of these kids who are literally destroying you by your own words. They're using your own words against you like I am right now. You're so hypocritical and so degenerative that it's funny to look at your channel and profile honestly i want to cry myself to the point where i kill myself in my sleep when i watch your channel when i watch your profile anyways this was all i had to say thank you so much for watching this video and i'll see you guys in the next video peace bye